What is up everybody, it's your boy Zombie the Greatest and welcome back to another YouTube video. Leave a like on this video. Hey, can we go for 15 likes on today's video, guys? Let's, let's go ahead and get a number going. Let's go for 15 likes on today's video and let's get on into this video. Yo, we have brand new Dragon Ball transfers and links and updates coming in like two days. This is supposed to be dropping on October 25th. This was dropped by the official Dragon Ball Breakers Twitter page. Uh, not even, I think this yesterday or like, I think in between yesterday and today. So we're gonna be getting into these screenshots and basically going into, you know, basically what they posted. So you guys have a full overview of what you're gonna be updating on Friday and my excitement and thoughts of it as well. So let's get into this. So we have three new transfers will be available at Spirit Siphon on October 28th. Equip Cells Transfer and activate the perfect Kamehameha. I just want to stop there because this is crazy, yo. I, they're adding literally not only hero abilities, but villain abilities for you to play as a survivor, but they're adding more and more moves to add that repertoire of moves. So now survivors are not only gonna have something to play for, but they're gonna have something to defend themselves with. So for example, what I mean by that is Cell, obviously fighting a Raider Cell, his move is the perfect Kamehameha. We have, us having that ability, will definitely be able to have an advantage using that siphon because we both have the perfect Kamehameha. I'm not sure entirely how it's gonna work, but I love that they're putting these moves in and siphon and using these uh, all the characters so that we can actually play as every single one even at the same time you can load up a self siphon or a self transfer with a goku one like it, it it's they're literally making this game so that we can create it on our own this game is not going to need mods we're going to be modding it in the game so this is pretty cool i, I love how they're doing this let's, let's continue stand against the raider with power powerful super attack so yeah this this looks like it's going to be a, a really really high level super attack this is, doesn't seem like it's gonna be oh you just oh this is gonna attack that you have like piccolo or goku or anything like that it's gonna seem like it's gonna have some level or some tier to it i'm not sure how they're gonna do it maybe you have to spend more of your siphon tickets to get it or you may have to do something extra i'm not sure but it seems like they're talking about it as if it's like an ultimate rather than just a regular super attack if that makes sense i hope that makes sense all right, moving on to the next screenshot. We've got the transfer, Majin Buu. You can stop the Raider's action by using the Go Go Gum active skill. It is useful skill to run away from the Raider or to defend the Super Time Machine. The new three transfers are scheduled to release October 28th. You, you, you read it, look, look at it. So basically we can turn the Raider into gum. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Either that, or we turn it into gun, or we wrap it around in the thing. Oh, yeah, I'm looking at the picture now. <laughs> um, upon further inspection of the picture that they've provided, it looks like the go-go gum means you can wrap the raider and trap him in a gum, or a piece, a long string of gum. That's, that's, we're getting different types of ways to defeat the raider. It isn't just one way to defeat the raider, and you have many different options. They're literally giving us the tools to just make this game what we want to make it. And I love it. I love it. Moving on. So we have the last one, my pride and joy, my personal favorite, the freezer one. So we have the passive skill for freezer. So I love what they do. I want to stop there too. I love what they're doing too. One's a super attack. One's more of like a trap type of attack. And then this one here, is, it says it's a passive skill. Special service will reduce the cooldown time of dragon change. If you... if it is very useful skill when defending a super time machine. So this is this is pretty cool. So I just want to add this. So I just dropped a another video previously that talked about your dragon charge or your dragon change charging up on its own. If you have this, will that double? That would be so cool if it would double. So you will have the power charger as your passive skill. Then you will have the freezer transfer as your as your extra one when you use it and it just built it probably will build it up instantly that's that's pretty insane they're giving this not only are they giving the raiders the power but they're they're slowly giving the survivors the upper hand so that it it is balanced in the game the game is actually becoming balanced you're not only giving us moves that we can use with the survivors but you're giving it to us the same moves if not um used in better ways for the raider so the Raiders not just using OP moves, we're using some of their moves as well to incorporate into our skill set. And I just feel like that's a that's a really good, really good way to start off and in leading into it. And I'm glad they're doing these updates. I can't fathom that we wait three months 
for another update or something like that or for another skin or something that, 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 that didn't make any sense to me some people were like oh the game is gonna just fall off before the update because you know they're they're, they're not gonna update it frequently and it, the next one season is in three months you, come on three months they're not gonna sit here and leave us dry for three months if they do that's trash that is trash this game needs to be updating every two weeks or every week period point blank but hey i appreciate it, appreciate you guys for listening in and vibing with me on my excitement for this game leave a like on this video let's get to 15 likes you guys leave a like on this video subscribe if you are new and we will get on to some more dragon ball games content yo we got some more z hey, z hey that dlc is coming closer than y'all think it's almost november fall is technically here dlc coming out y'all you got at least two more dlc packs for zeta rest 2 and then we can finally see if we can get a Zeta Wars 3. But I, I'm just going to leave it off there, guys. Hope you guys take care of yourselves. Let's get it.